the skies are changing. For decades, air superiority relied on human pilots, fast reflexes, and expensive jets. The risks included the potential loss of lives. But that time may be coming to an end. A new machine has just completed its first air-to-air -air engagement. It wasn't a fighter jet. It was Bayraktar Kazadalma, a fully unmanned, stealthy, AI-driven combat aircraft. Its latest test could change how nations fight in the air. To grasp the significance of this test, we must look back. Two decades ago, drones were basic reconnaissance tools. Then, armed drones such as the Bayraktar TB2 transformed conflicts from Syria to Ukraine. Turkey, once a newcomer, advanced quickly through innovation and continuous testing. Baikar, the company behind this change, progressed from small UAVs to powerful combat drones like a Kinsey. Yet, one goal remained, a drone that could fly like a fighter, think like a computer, and fight without fear. Kazalalma is not just another UAV. It is the world's first operational, jet-powered, stealth-configured, unmanned fighter with a low radar signature and high maneuverability. It can perform aggressive actions without risking a pilot. It's built to operate from ships like TCG Anadolu, giving Turkey a floating fleet of unmanned jets. Inside, its AI systems can detect threats, calculate firing solutions, and respond in milliseconds. This isn't remote control, it's autonomous air combat. In November 2025, Bayraktar Kuzalelma achieved a significant milestone. It flew alongside two Turkish F-16 seconds and conducted a fully simulated beyond visual range air-to-air -air engagement, marking a first for a Turkish unmanned jet. Using the Murad Isa radar, Kuzalelma detected and locked onto the target F-16, then performed a perfect virtual Gugduan missile launch. No live missile was fired but the entire kill chain was completed electronically, ending with a predicted direct hit. It was a short test, but a historic one. Kuzalelma demonstrated its ability to track, target, and engage fighter-class aircraft taking on roles that were once only for manned jets. This test is important because it breaks one of the last barriers for unmanned combat aircraft. If a drone can shoot down another plane, even in simulation, it means the age of unmanned air dominance is no longer just a theory. Kazalama can patrol dangerous airspace without putting a pilot at risk. It can defend itself against fighters. It can overwhelm enemy defenses with its numbers, autonomy, and cost efficiency. With each test, Turkey is establishing itself as one of the fastest growing drone powers in the world. Kazalama's next mission is even larger to operate alongside manned jets like the F 16 and Turkey's next-generation fighter, can Picture a pilot commanding multiple Kuzalelmas as autonomous wingmen. Each one would track threats, launch attacks, and react faster than any human could. AI dogfighting simulations already show that machines can outperform pilots. Now, with real beyond visual range engagement tests completed, unmanned fighters are getting ready to take the lead in air combat. For a century, the world's top pilots ruled the sky. But every era comes to an end. Kizalama's air-to-air -air test is not just a technological milestone. It signals that the next chapter of air warfare will be shaped by machines that react faster, fly without risk, and fight without hesitation. The age of the unmanned fighter has begun, and Kuzalelma is at the forefront.